Hey Taurus, how's it going? It's Ashley from Serendipity Tarot. This is a quick love reading, tarot reading for you guys. Um, this is focusing on your person, whoever you're thinking about dealing with. We're going to see what their intentions are, their desires for you, for the connection. Okay, we're going to see what, kind of what's going on. Um, if this reading resonates for you, be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I upload your extended bonus reading is up on Vimeo if you want to check that out the link would be in the description box and a quick announcement I do have my Halloween sale all my tarot ooh, and oracle decks are 15% off on my Etsy shop if you guys want to check them out okay let's jump right in Taurus Taurus in love Taurus in love all right, so who, what is going on with Taurus's person? Taurus's person, what are their intentions? What are their desires? Taurus's person, whoever Taurus is in love with, whoever they're thinking about regarding love. Um, we have, ooh, the princess of wands and verse, okay? So page of wands and verse. Someone is exploring options here, trying to explore a new direction with you, Taurus. I feel like this is someone who's taking a step back in a recent past. Maybe they haven't shown as much interest in you. Maybe they haven't been taking much action at all, Taurus. I'm getting someone here has maybe disappeared from your sight. Um, maybe there's a lack of movement, a lack of change with this page of wands and verse. I feel like this is someone who, um, you may feel as if they stop desiring you. You may feel like they, they don't care right but truth is with the three of cups here okay this is someone who wants to um, have friendship with you they want to come together they want to celebrate they want to go back to where you guys had good times there's the energy of coming back together having a reunion um being happy with you so this is something here that they're thinking about they do desire some kind of reunion and getting back in your good graces i'm also seeing the knight of wands okay so this is someone who wants to take action towards you we have someone who wants to start things up stir things up uh the wands about action right moving forward instigating trying to um um pick things up okay there's the energy of action progression so what i'm seeing taurus is that your person does want to come in with the knight of wands energy it could be a leo a sag and aries um let's see what else we can find out and we have the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. So they want to move towards some kind of secure establishment, some kind of relationship. They may want a commitment with you, Taurus. You're on your mind. They look at you as a very secure option. I feel like this is someone who may lack security in their life with the Knight of Wands, right? And so they, it's like they look to you as someone that, you know, can change that for them. They can build with. So this is someone who um, may feel as if when you guys come together, there's real growth, right? There's potential. So they're thinking about opportunities, um, and these opportunities include um, you, includes moving forward with you, and maybe even having some kind of commitment. So let's see else on their mind. We have the Four of Cups. This is someone who feels like they've messed up, and we have the Seven of Swords and Verse. On their mind is missing an opportunity with you. There's some cups here. There's some sadness. There's some regrets. This is someone who may feel like, I let you down, Taurus. I shouldn't have done that. I hurt you. I've disappointed you big time. Um, with that Seven of Swords and Verse, okay, I feel like someone was being very sneaky. We had that little fox energy there. Um, someone was being sneaky, was lying, not being truthful. It could be the energy of, you know, cheating, going behind your back, doing something here. This is someone who wants to clear the air because they feel like that's the reason why an opportunity has been missed. And I also see with the four cups that this is someone who may not be interested in other people. And so maybe they cheat on you. Maybe they um, did something here regarding a third party, but then they're realizing that it wasn't worth it. And a missed opportunity here with you, Taurus. And I feel like with that meditation energy, the four cups, they're thinking about that. They're now thinking like, wow, I really um, suffered some major losses because I hurt Taurus. I, I, I underestimated Taurus, you know. <laughs> I took advantage of Taurus with that seven of swords. And I'd rather right my wrongs and have another opportunity with Taurus than miss this opportunity altogether. So they see you um, with the four of swords and verse. They see you resting. They see you regrouping. They see you spending a lot of time by yourself, um, needing time to rejuvenate, to recuperate. They see you as not really wanting to be bothered by this connection right now. Okay, We also have the princess of cups. They see you as someone they want to apologize to. They want to offer, um, you know their cup it could be very small but it's kind of like Taurus I'm thinking of you I care about you 
I miss you. So there could be an apology coming in or they look at you as someone who um, may need an apology. Maybe you made it very clear to them, Taurus, that you're not going to move forward with them unless they apologize, right? They right their wrong. So they see you as someone they still care about. I do feel like this is someone who also dreams about you with that page of cups energy. You're in their feelings. You're in their thoughts, <laughs> their memories of the past. They're constantly thinking about you, right? And they can't seem to move on without that without those feelings, right, um, re-emerging. So I feel like this is someone who knows that you need space. You're not happy with them right now, but they know why, okay? They know why, and I think that they want to get back in your life, and that's why we have that page of cups. They may want to apologize for something so that, you know, you look at them differently. Now, we also have the Ten of Wands in reverse, and we have the King of Pentacles in reverse, okay? So that's your energy. What is telling me, Taurus, that your person wants to drop the burdens here, right? They look at you as um, someone, maybe you turned your back on them, right? Because you're coming out in a burst. So they feel like they lost on a fight with you. They they, they, they lost you. They, um, they look at you as not caring anymore. They look at you as not investing in this opportunity with them anymore. They look at you as... Um, just, you know, you have your back turned for them. So you're just not as interested. And so this is someone who wants to overcome these blockages, these burdens, these walls that they've created between you and them. They're wanting to move past it. They're wanting to resolve the issues. They want things to get easier. They don't always want it to be so difficult, you know, when they want to go to reach out to you, right? When they have these feelings about you and Taurus and they just want you there, when they want you in your presence, they don't want to feel like <laughs> there is an army they have to go through in order to get you in their life, right? In order to see you, in order to be around you. So there's something here about overcoming the burdens that they've created. We have the five of wands in reverse and we have the emperor in reverse. See, the thing is about I'm seeing this person, Taurus, realizing that there's a lot of work, right? They have to come up with a plan. They have to come up with a strategy. They can't just like walk right in your life and think that everything's going to be fine, right? Because the way things left off is telling me there may have been a lot of fights. There may have been a lot of disappointments with the five of wands. There may have been some competition, right? Maybe you felt you had to compete for this person's time, attention, love. Maybe you felt like you, you weren't important. You are on the bottom of their priority list, right? And so there's something about them realizing that um, and you know, really not having a plan yet, okay, on how to make this happen with the Emperor and Averse. I feel like this is someone who's trying to figure out what the next steps are, but I don't think they figured it all out, okay? They still got some work to do. Um, we also have the Ace of Wands in Verse and the Three of Swords. This person's really hurt. I feel like they're hurt because they know they hurt you, Taurus, and that wasn't their real intentions. I feel like this is someone who's also waiting for you to heal. Um, they're waiting for you to move past some kind of hurt that they've caused you. They're waiting for you to um, no longer be upset with them. No longer in this energy of pain. Because some of you guys just tell me that they look at you as being hurt and therefore, um, you know, you may be very angry at them. So there is some sorrow, okay? Four of Cups, we have Three of Swords and Verses. A lot of sorrow, a lot of pain, a lot of emotions. Um, and so that is delaying action right now. The Ace of Wands and Verse, it's like they want to take action. There's a desire to take action. There's uh, a desire to have movement, but they feel like right now they may not have it in them. They may not have a plan. Again, they may not know what to do right now. As far as the outcome, Taurus, we have the uh, Six of Cups in reverse and the High Priestess. So you could expect this person, Taurus, to be somewhat secretive. I feel a lot of you guys, they haven't been talking. Maybe they've been very silent, right? They've been kind of, um, you know, interested in you wanting to take moves, but they've been kind of in the back seat, right? Kind of like not really... Um, reaching out, okay, very silent about their feelings for you, not really telling you their intentions, um, but definitely still in their feelings, right? So this is definitely someone here whose intentions are to come back in your life, but there's there's some disappointment here, again, that they're feeling, and the disappointment is within themselves for not doing something or the way they did something. But what's clear is that they want the Ten of Pentacles, this is in their energy, they want movement, they want change, Knight of Wands, I want to come back in your life, Taurus, I want to be that person that you can rely on. Let's grow. Let's establish something very strong. And let's have this reunion, Three Cups. Let's come back together. Let's make this happen, right? So that is what I'm seeing. Let's get some divine love messages. This deck is also 15% off, okay, on my Etsy shop for those of you guys who are interested. Isolation, it says a withdrawal is necessary for peace of mind and emotional recovery. So that's kind of what's going on, right? 
Taurus, your person is kind of withdrawn. They're isolated. They're not talking. They're not reaching out. They're in that high priestess energy. It could be a Pisces here. And it's really because like there's conflict, right? And they feel like right now I have to remove myself from conflict, right? I've caused a lot of hurt to Taurus. I have to... Um, I have to try to bring back peace to this connection. And it's probably best I remove myself from the whole situation. We have misguided. Someone was misled down the wrong path. That was not for their divine good. So Taurus, this is your person's energy, realizing that they were misguided, right? They chose someone else. They chose another path. They chose another opportunity. And it wasn't the right decision, okay? It wasn't for their divine good. Now they're realizing it. We have the collaboration energy. There is a willingness for both parties to cooperate and unify. So there's the energy of let's cooperate, let's unify, let's come together, let's let's have unity, let's have peace, let's have harmony, let's be friends, right? Three cups. So your person's intentions are to come together and collaborate with you again, okay? So that is what I'm seeing, Taurus. Um, if this is your reading, I hope you enjoyed it. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Again, my Halloween sale, 15% off all my Oracle and Tarot decks on my Etsy shop only till October 31st. So um, be sure to take advantage of the offer if you're interested. All right. See you guys later. Bye.